to my life. How are you doing today? I hope that you're fine, happy, and healthy. This is your budget friend Josie. If you're new here, I welcome you in this family. And if you're a returning subscriber, I welcome you back and I'm so happy that you're here to support this channel. I'm doing anything related to budgeting, cash stuffing, sinking funds, that snowball payoffs, and some DIYs for arts and crafts. If this interests you, then please hit like and subscribe to this channel. So for tonight, I'll be doing my budget with me for the month of December 2021. I put a little bit of decoration to fill the Christmas spirit. I already wrote down the categories so it will not be time consuming. So for this month, my salary, I only budgeted 2000 and for the cash roll over, since you saw my last video about my plan for 2022 and I also did um, remove my savings challenge money. So that cash roll over um, was total of 808.10 because I also included the um annual fee for the credit card and then um i received a gift and i won uh 25 us dollars from next first steps and budget so i include that one in my gifts and rewards and someone also sent me 15 dollars um so the total reward that i received or gifts that I received this month is $45.35 and for others I'll just leave it blank as of the moment so if I calculate it the budgeted income for this month is 2853.45 for the fixed expenses my phone bill will be due on the 15th so this one is the new phone that i have so this is 75.52 and then my insurance is every fifth of the month so it's 141.18 then my family i budgeted 850 dollars for the tights 200 and for the bank fee I put $16. So if I total all this, total of $1,282.70. So if I subtract this from my income of $2,853.45. For the fixed expenses of 1282.70 so my expected balance would be 1770.75 okay so we go now to my debt so my credit card i still budget uh 100 dollars for my debt one it's 300 dollars and for my housing loan, $136. So if I total this, the total debt would be $536. So if I subtract this, with the remaining balance of $1,570.75, the balance would be 1034.75 so now we'll go to the variable expenses so the grocery i budgeted 50 dollars for my allowance it's 20 for the transportation the presto is 15 dollars dine out is 20 for the crafts is $20 giveaways I have budgeted $30 Selenius is $20 and this is the annual credit card that I'll be paying and that is $90 so if I total all this
equals $265. So if we subtract it, the balance is 1034.75 minus the variable expenses of 265. So I have a remaining balance of 769.75. So for the savings challenge, I will put $125 in my calamity fund and then in my emergency fund, I put the $500 in the savings challenge. I'll put $84.05 um, in the safety funds. I'll put $50. And in the cushion, I'll put uh, the remaining 10.70. So if I total all this, so the total would be 769.75. So if I subtract this, with the remaining balance of 769.75 so that will be a zero base budget so that's it guys this is my budget plan for the month of december 2021 i already did the savings challenges and restocked the money that i took from the some of my sinking funds and envelopes so i will only do um cash stuffing for the variable expenses so I'll put this aside first so for tonight I will do my cash stuffing and I will use my cash tray so I will only do my variable expenses I already put the money in the bank for the credit card and for the giveaway so i only do the grocery allowance my transportation dine out for the crafts and for the miscellaneous so i will only do a total of 145 dollars so i have the money here so let's count the money 50 70 90 110 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 35. So I have a total of $145 to be cashed up tonight. So I will use my DIY cash tray that I did. And I will only do the cash topping in my FED. Um, Binder. Okay, for dine out, I will put twenty. So this is empty. So it's twenty. And then for grocery, I will put fifty. This is also empty. Nothing for toiletries. Giving, I still have 20 here. So, for presto, I'll put 15. 10, 15. And then for my allowance, I'll be putting 20. Because it's also empty. And for miscellaneous, I will put 20. So 10, 15, 20. And for the craft, I'll put the last 20. So 5, 10, 15, 20. So that's it, guys. The rest will be cash roll over and salt and tea. So that is my short cash stuffing and budget with me for the month of December 2021. I hope that you learned something from me today. 
if you have any comments or suggestions what you would like me to do to help me improve in my budgeting method please do comment down below and i will try my very best to reply to you and please hit like and subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell for more updates on my next video thank you so much for the love and support that you always give to me i truly appreciate each and every one of you and always remember that if you are saving you are succeeding again this is your budget friend josie and i'll see you again on my next videos take care and god bless bye